What's up, YouTube, and welcome back to Scorcher's Lounge. Have you ever saw Instagram raffles, YouTube raffles, Facebook raffles, just raffles in general with the wheel of names? Have you ever wondered if it's fake or legit? Well, I'm going to show you how I won a $450 pair of sneakers for only 30 bucks. I already know what this is and we're bringing back the handy dandy Brian knife so I already know what this is but this shoe goes between uh, four and five hundred dollars and I got it for thirty dollars I'll put the screenshot right there so you can see so you know there's a lot of raffles online obviously online right does it what the hell with this tape jeez have to do it this way with the point i don't want to do it hard because i don't want to break the box all right so there it is there's a lot of raffles online um and you know some of them are fake and some of them are real and legit um obviously the one i'm a part of is real and legit and i mentioned this guy at least maybe 10 times seven times already in my channel um, which his name is salute my kicks New Jersey and the first time I played I, I have a whole video up I'll see if I can find the link and I'll put it up here um, somewhere up there uh, when I first fell into him it, well, you know I was skeptical too you know because number one I don't like fakes and number two I don't want to get scammed so I remember I won his raffle for 12, I think it was 10, 12 dollars. I just said, fuck it, I got 10 dollars. Let me just send that, see what happens, boom, boom. And I end up winning, bro. And I won, I think it was like 1,500 dollars, something like that, something crazy. And then I was like, he was like, yo, do you want all these sneakers? You know, you could pick up to 10 sneakers or eight, whatever it was. And he says, I didn't know, bro, and I, and I didn't know about the sneakers being real or fake. I said, no, give me the money. He said, all right, no problem, boom. He sent me the money next day, no problem. Um, then I was like, okay, you sent me the money that quick? Money, ch I was about to start tripping because <laughs> the lid is not on the box. It's actually stuck in here. <laughs> so he sent me the money quick, you know, gained my confidence. I did it again, boom, boom. And then I end up becoming a regular man. And I got, I got a lot of sneakers from this guy. Now, unfortunately, a lot of the sneakers I got from him is not in my collection because a lot of the sneakers I got from him, I had already gotten. However, it was cool to double up, even triple up, and then sell some. This, right, this pair right here is actually a pair that I had my hands on like three or four times, and I just got rid of them all the time. And you know what? I might keep this one. So, um, I won the raffle wheel for 30 bucks. No, let me see. It was $12 a slot. 12, 12, 12. $36. I won this shoe. Jordan won. Actually, I haven't done a review of this shoe and I have so many. So let's rewind it. And I'm going to do an actual review and I'm going to salute my kicks collab. Not collab, but I'm going to just mention it. All right. So we got the Jordan 1 traditional box. Then we get to the label. Label reads Air Jordan 1 Retro High OG Size 10 and a half My size Sale Black Are you ready? Are you ready to see What's in here? Matter of fact I'm not even going to see the other color Matter of fact I have to see the other color I feel weird if I don't Dark Mocha Got the Mocha Ones, baby. For retail price, uh, I guess, I think it was 170 The Mocha Ones. Remember when this shoe was at the $700 mark? Jeez. I have Mocha Ones, baby. Got the Mocha Ones. Ah, oh, yes. Mocha Ones. Mocha 
Collins. All right, so let's put, you know, hold on. Let me, you know what I'm saying? Let me do a little, yeah, I'm trying. All right, so got the Jordan 1 Mocha 1 for $36. I put three three entries in the raffle and I won a five, a $450 shoe. Now, I had my hands on this at least four or five times. I, I mean, in my size, I actually had like 10 of these. Like when I was winning a lot of these raffles, bro, I got, I was just getting more because it was so easy to flip. At that time, they were going for six, seven hundred. And then also I won um, Foot Locker, you know, stuff like that. But the thing is, I got the Travis High Mocha ones. And I, I actually wore this shoe like three or four times already, the one that I had. And then my boy ended up falling in love with it. And I was like, you know what, bull? I said, bull. <laughs> you know what, homie? Like, I got the Mocha One High Travis. Basically, it's almost the same thing, kind of. Like, I don't really need it, I guess. I, I, I'll, I'll hook you up. So I sold it to him for a deal. Worn two or three times. Sold to him for a deal. Not even a deal, a steal, because that's the homie. But anyways, let's go with the shoe. Got the whole black traditional black one bottom right there going up to the midsole you got that cell missile makes it look so good going up to the upper side panels right here then you have your sail toe i'm sorry your, your black toe cap and leather going to the eyelets and the nike swoosh is also black leather when we get to the tongue it's also an age looking tongue tongue <laughs> tongue um all sale then you have your black tag with the nike swoosh on the tongue tag going to the inside going to the inside we have oh we got sale laces forgot about that and we have nike air and sale as well now this pair is from stock x he actually had the stock X sticker. Let's see what head and fold. Jordan 1 Dark Mocha. I'm going to cover the order number and everything. You know what I'm saying? But he paid, whoever, whoever paid for this ended up paying $468. $468 they end up paying for this shoe. I end up paying $36. <laughs> <laughs> like I said, I won a whole bunch of times from Salute My Kicks. I had a video um, putting everything together. Um, go ahead and check them out, man. 100% legit. And like I said, like I sold a lot of his pairs. Never had a problem. He's cool people, man. Like I said, just join the raffle. Take your little chances. You could even cash out. If you want if you want to test it for yourself, let's say you win and you don't want like sneakers and stuff, cash out. You know what I mean? Because there's a cash out option. Me, I already trust the guy. We got a, we have a great business relationship going. I already trust the guy. So I, I just get sneakers. I already know all his sneakers is legit. He got over like 400 pairs of sneakers. We went to sneaker con together. Um, I went up and I ended up chilling in his booth and his table. So hopefully he comes to sneaker con again. Speaking of sneaker con, do you want to go to sneaker con Philadelphia? Do you want to meet Scorchers Lounge? Well, not Scorchers Lounge. Do you want to meet me from Scorchers Lounge? I will be. I'm so stupid, bro. I will be at Philadelphia Sneaker Con Saturday, February 17. Eagles have already lost. Damn it. But I wish I could have just started. E hey, I'm still going to do the Eagles chant. But I will be there at Sneaker Con. Um, I'll bring a couple shirts with me. So if y'all want to buy merch, I'll give it to you at more of a discounted price. Um, I have a couple of shirts with me. I have a wagon with a few pairs I might trade or sell or something like that. And yeah, just uh, if you see me, don't be scared. You know, we, I'll take a picture with you or say hi to you or bust it up with you. You can ask me questions. I'll be interviewing people, which is my favorite thing to do. But anyways, back to the sneaker. Let me hurry up with this review because I'm all over the place. All right, so it comes with black laces but then you got your extra cell laces right here got your stock gas tag i'm gonna leave everything like this because i'm not sure if i'm gonna sell this again or if i'm gonna keep it i mean 36 dollars 
is such a good way to come up, right? I paid $36 for a $500 shoe, or I paid $36 and I'm gonna sell it and make 100 times the profit. Either way, I win, right? So I don't know what I'm gonna do yet, so I'm just gonna leave everything the way it is, think about it, you know what I'm saying? And then maybe if I'm, if I'm gonna keep it, this is coming off for sure, the stock X tag. Going to the heel, cause it's got the black toe color blocking. Anything with the black toe color blocking, you have the black toe cap, and then you have the heel in a different color. So the heel is your dark mocha, what Travis Scott made oh so famous. And a person like me loves it because I love the autumn neutral colors. Beige, khaki, brown, dark brown, burgundy, olive, you, you, yo. That's my jam. So anyways, you got beautiful, uh, probably like a seven, seven out of 10 good suede right here. This whole shoe is good quality. It ain't great, but it's good quality. It ain't, you know, it's, they, they put their time on this. Going up to the collar, you have your sale collar on the upper part of the collar. Then when you get to the upper part of the suede, you have your black wings logo. Tell me what you guys think. Should I keep the shoe? If you want me to keep the shoe, type in keep. I got it for $36. If you want me to sell it and make, I don't even know, a hundred million times my profit because I got it for 36. Yo, this is like 15 times my profit, bro. So do I keep it for 36 in my collection i don't have this no more i had a million of them and i kept selling them even my personal pair i sold it to my homie i do have the travis one high mocha which is the reason why i let this one go do i keep it for 36 dollars or do i sell it and make 15 times my profit um you guys tell me either keep or sell type it in the comments keep or sell also don't forget i will be at sneaker con philadelphia i'm gonna say this in every single video until sneaker con i want the loungers to come out and show out if you're in the philadelphia area i will be at sneaker con saturday february 17 baby so we have the Jordan 1 Mocha. Salute My Kicks was the source. And I don't know if I should keep or sell. So that's a review of the Jordan 1 Mocha. The story behind how I got this pair of the Jordan 1 Mocha. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And also share it. Like I said, it costs nothing to do any of that stuff until next time loungers peace out